fortunate we have, uh, we have a young man really big in the junior high circuit right now. Okay? Uh, real regular down here. First with a fake ID. Let me welcome to the stage for your entertainment, Alden Moody! So yeah, my name is Alden, and I do these comedy shows with my father who you haven't seen yet, but he's here, and we'll be doing comedy. And sometimes I do better, and sometimes he does better. Last time, though, <laughs> he did really bad, <laughs> which is okay, though at the airport I did scream, you bombed, <laughs> which wasn't the right place to say it. Next thing I know, the security guards gave me some ice cream, giving him something called a cavity search. <laughs> now I understand why he was mad. I hate the dentist, too. <laughs> so I'm 13, and I'm not allowed to swear on stage. Not because of my parents, because this well-mannered Canadian man came up to me while I was practicing and was like, no, you shouldn't swear. And I was like, okay. Uh, he was speaking French, I don't actually know what he's saying, but I assume that what it was. <laughs> but anyway, whenever I say the word broccoli, you need to insert your favorite swear word. <laughs> the reason I pick broccoli is... <laughs> what was that? <laughs> What'd you say? Okay. Move on. <laughs> now, anyway, the reason I pick broccoli is I hate vegetables. There's absolutely no other reason I would ever say that word. And by the way, the whole idea that I can't curse on stage is a bunch of rock. <laughs> So you know my name is Alden, that's, that's Alden, but some people, they mispronounce it, all done. So on the first day of school, my teacher says, all done, <laughs> all done, all done. So I'm like, yes, I am, and I left. <laughs> Sometimes, my, my classmates, Say all done. That annoys me so much. I want them to get a cavity search. <laughs> and when, you know, I can't stand people who say it was an accident when it really was on purpose, right? Yeah. Yeah. See? Yeah. See? Like I overheard my parents saying all done was an accident. <laughs> Did that night was on purpose. <laughs> or on vodka. <laughs> you know, some people think we shouldn't shop at certain stores because of politics. And I think that's crazy. I mean, I know people who don't shop at Hobby Lobby because, well, they don't want to use Obamacare. <laughs> and I know people who eat, don't eat at Chick-fil-A because they are opposed to gay marriage. It is true. <laughs> For me, I don't eat at Panda Express because it's not real panda meat. <laughs> They're liars! They're dirty liars! <laughs> Okay, I know. 
What about some small, cute, furry thing that people want to keep as a pet? I was hoping that when I went to the big Panda Express, they'd have cages and you got to pick out your own candle like you could do lobsters. <laughs> that one looks me. I'll take Bow Bow and Ling Ling with a side of Komodo Dragon Fries. <laughs> Thank you for the light, sir. <laughs> If you don't know, every three minutes, when you're three minutes in, you get a little light up there. Thank you. <laughs> but anyway, I assumed they were being eaten, and that's why they were in danger. Apparently, the people are killing bandits for the fur. That made me sad. Because those douches are keeping all the meat to themselves. <laughs> Broccoli, yeah! <laughs> Those broccolis are keeping all the meat to themselves. <laughs> but I have a safety announcement for all of you. All you wonderful people out here. If you ever go to Prescott and you say Prescott, the locals will get mad at you. <laughs> they say it's supposed to be called Prescott. That is not what I learned in school. C O T T spells cot. Now we don't really need the extra T, but we'll add it in there anyway. I T spells it. This explains why Arizona is ranked 51st out of 50 states in education. <laughs>